Now that the neural uplink has been successfully installed, I can access my full database. Director Hill is reviewing the SHIELD protocols that you also recovered. Feeling better, Jarvis? Everything seems to be in working order. You have no idea how much this means to me. To SHIELD. Thank you, Bruce. You too, Kamala. With this, I can start rebuilding SHIELD in earnest. If you ever need anything, give me a call. I'm sure we'll be seeing a lot more of each other. Looking forward to it, Director. I feel like I should salute or something. No, no need for that. Good luck, both of you. Jarvis, you think you can get us Tony? This will take some time, but I should be able to find Mr. Stark. In the meantime, I've uncovered something that might be of interest to Miss Khan in the harm room. The what now? The holographic augmented reality machine. Something the Avengers use for training. Whoa, that sounds awesome. I should warn you, the system may be a little irregular. Is this safe? Only 0.0001% chance of injury. Uh, okay. <laughs> I trust you, I guess. Proceed through the crew quarters. The harm room is on the lower floor of the hangar bay. Thanks, Jarvis. live from the Olympia Research Campus in the Pacific Northwest. What you just witnessed was blurry footage from an older phone, but there's no mistake. This is where the Avengers hung out. Do you think there's still soda in these? Eh, probably all flat after five years. I received this from an anonymous source who described waking up at his campsite to the sound of gunfire. Two soda machines? The second one was installed at Mr. Odinson's request. It dispensed mead. There used to be a sign. This is Phil Schultz. It's still hard to believe all this is real. I mean, I just flew on a Quinjet to a secret shield base. Uh, we saw Nick Fury, and, and now I'm talking to Jarvis and not keeping my cool at all. <laughs> Sorry. No need to apologize, Miss Khan. Powering up. Whoa! Uh, oh, what? Welcome to the holographic augmented reality machine. I'm Iron Man! Indeed. I crashed in Mr. Stark's old combat simulator. I hope you don't mind. Are you kidding? I am Iron Man! <laughs> Do your work, virtual bad guys!
will do, I think. Well done.
It's over? Let's do it again! If you wish. But I believe I've located Mr. Stark. Oh, uh, on my way. Mr. Stark's last known location is his ancestral home, Golden Acres. You may be able to find a clue to his current whereabouts there. Never heard of it. He really does not want to be found. Indeed not. The estate was located in a remote area of Nevada. I can provide you with the precise coordinates. Dr. Banner, I have completed the scans you requested and have discovered residual traces of gamma radiation in a remote area of the Pacific Northwest. It is likely that Ms. Rappuccini is experimenting with your research there. I have marked the location on the war table. What is it, Jarvis? Per your request, I've been scanning for residual gamma radiation. I've detected large quantities coming from a complex deep inside AIM territory. AIM and gamma? How? Monica's trying to replicate my research. And I gave her everything she needed. I'm sorry, Bruce. I trusted her. I assume you'd like to infiltrate the facility? And make sure she's stopped. Yes. Where are we headed? I've uploaded the coordinates to the Quinjet. Ever since Monica co-founded AIM, Dr. Banner has feared the amount of gamma radiation research she amassed while they were colleagues. Recently, I've detected residual gamma radiation coming from a remote AIM facility. Dr. Banner would like you to infiltrate the gamma radiation lab and destroy any research you find. Dr. Banner has pre-recorded a message for you, Hulk. <sighs> hey, big guy. Um, if Monica's there, just do the job, okay? Listen to Jarvis and Kamala if they tell you to rein it in. And uh, thank you. You're stopping what I can. The gamma readings are coming from an underground facility not far from your current location. This is in the heart of AIM territory. Yes. There will be significant resistance on your path.
Look out. Got some bad guys. There are several scouting parties in the area. Best be on alert. There it is. Time to take out those guards. Abomination was created here? Unlikely. Ames holdings were diminutive when Abomination first appeared. It is possible he was enhanced here, however. Not comforting. This is the server floor for Ames Gamma Research Program. Don't let them get to the surface. There is a chest with special resources close to your location.
Resistance ally is in trouble nearby and needs your help. That terminal will give you access to the Gamma Laboratory ahead. Research data is housed on several servers to prevent loss during power failures. You will have to destroy them all to prevent further experiments. Security, what's going on? I'm getting alerts across the board. I'll handle it, Doctor. All units, stop them! It appears Dr. Rappuccini is aware of your presence. Hulk, you should have stayed in the desert. in the eye want to destroy my work. Give her what she wants. The elevator has been unlocked. You may proceed down into the facility. <gasps> Seems like the big guy doesn't like Monica very much either. I do not have much data on the shared emotional relationships between Dr. Banner and the Hulk. Could be he's like a bloodhound who can sense bad people just by smelling them. I'm not sure he'd appreciate the comparison. <laughs> Don't care. Alright, time to 
time to find Monica. You really are that gullible, aren't you? Wait, what? Barricade the door, protect the research lab. Look for a chest containing special resources nearby. <gasps> Team, kill the Hulk. Our pleasure, Doctor. She's such a coward. has been neutralized. Knock him down like bowling pins. Firing! Theta team, I thought I made myself clear. Sword loser one? It appears this Gamma Research installation has been rendered inoperable. Make sure Bruce gets this message. You are going to regret this with every fiber of your being. Yeah, no. I don't think we will. The Avengers are going to take you down, Monica. It's only a matter of time. Hey, big guy. I, uh, I appreciate the assist on this mission. I know you're not a fan of Code Green, but in order to bring the world back in balance, we need you out in the field. Destroying Monica's gamma research should keep her from creating an army of abominations. But, just in case, I've directed Jarvis to keep an eye out for any more signs of gamma emissions. If she brings another lab online, you'll be there to smash it. Check out the fancy drawbridge.
I can't believe we're about to knock on Tony Stark's door. <sighs> Me neither. Looks like the controls are on the other side. You think you can find a way over there? I mean, I could break through those rocks, but Green Guy isn't the best at talking things out. Good point. Part of being the Hulk. You gotta like something. Uh, we should really focus on the drawbridge. What are you gonna do? Stand around in silence the whole time? <sighs> yeah, great idea. Eh, suit yourself. More rocks? No problem. Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. I can see Golden Acres! Uh, kinda. Great. So, can you jump over and lower the bridge? Sure thing. You can make that jump. Just a little farther this time. Uh, made it! Uh... It's stuck on something. Oh, is it jammed? Hang on, I think I got it. <laughs> Ta-da! I hereby grant you passage to Sir Stark's fancy castle. <sighs> okay, calm down. Nice job. Sounds like he's up, at least. Isn't that one of his top five songs to kick, uh, butt to? Yep. Good old number four. And hello, Golden Acres! Uh, this can't be it. Let's get this over with. So, Tony Stark... The Tony Stark lives here? I appear so. Tony? Hey, Bruce. Long night? Ooh, long five years. <laughs> um, at least it's quiet. Yeah. It was. I... Uh. Hey, back off! Hi, I'm sorry. Who are you? Uh, Kamala? Well, uh, Kamala. Your Emeraldite friend here is kind of on my shit list. Okay. I deserve it. Yeah, you're damn right you deserved it. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Did you even check the science? Did you it was a heist, science? Bruce. No. We were outsmarted. No. The Terrigen reactor was unstable, <sighs> and you knew that, you knew that, and you still paraded it before the entire world. So what? We just give up? We didn't give up, Tony. We failed. At least I can admit that. No. No, we failed him. We failed him. Tony, I don't know how long you're gonna be mad at me, and to be honest with you, I don't really care. Take as long as you want. But, but the kid is inhuman. We did this. And she needs your help. I, I can't, I can't. You can't what, you're ditching me? 
Hey, don't take it personally, kid. No, this is what he does, isn't it? And why don't you take a good look around, huh? I can barely help myself. <laughs> this was a mistake. Now we agree on something. So you're both just gonna walk away? The Avengers were set up. Cap was murdered. You think I don't know that? Huh? I've replayed that day in my head a thousand times. The Avengers take the fall despite saving the day, and that bastard Charlton walks away smelling like a rose. And guess what? Guess what? No one cares. No one cares. The world needed someone to blame, and he gave them their scapegoat. So, unless you have some kind of astounding proof, I suggest you both get off my land. What is that? Proof. This better be good. Hmm. Kind of buried the lead, you know. Could have told me about that earlier. No, no, no. No sitting on my couch. You're still on the list. Where did you get this? I guess your password on some resistance blog. Impressive. Dude, your password was I am Iron Man. Really? Huh. Thought I'd change that. Son of a bitch. I know, it's incomplete. There's a whole folder on AIM's server. No, no, there's, there's more here. What? Yeah, look, it's smart. They encrypted it to look like a corrupt file. Need a few hours, I'll get all the rest. What is this? Who is, who is Tiny Dancer? Oh no. We gotta get out of here. What? You know this shameless Elton John fan? They helped me get out of Jersey. I wouldn't be here if they hadn't warned me about AIM. Really? Tiny Dancer? Look, we really should go. Now. Well, I would have gone with Rocket Man. Okay, I got to get dressed. You have a suit? Yeah, maybe, sort of. We'll see. Excuse me while I slip into something less comfortable. Bruce tries to saddle me with a stray fangirl. After all these years, he still can't own up to his own responsibilities. No, oh, son of a... Well, looks like Tiny Dancer was telling the truth. They found you, Bruce. Oh, great Nana's flying machine. Still a thing of beauty. Get airborne. More party crashers.
times. Gonna need a helmet. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Thing I don't have neighbors. They'd be so pissed off right now. You always love to make an entrance, Stark. How did I do? Uh, I'll give you a seven out of ten. Good to see you, Georgie boy. You been working out? Feel any other billion-dollar companies lately? Just yours. Hey! You're gonna pay for that window, Tarleton! This is your new place? But I expected more mirrors. I got rid of everything that didn't spark joy. Guess what pile you're in? Turn the girl over, Stark. And that will get you off my lawn. Uh... Mr. Stark... I'm joking, kid. Just stay near the nice green man. controlling these machines. I don't know. He got powers after the accident. I saw him controlling a robotic spider thing once. Well, he's leveled up from spiders. <laughs> nice moves, kiddo. Yeah, Paula. the Hulk, or as close as he'll let you. No, I got this. Watch. Wait, you're not ready for... Or maybe you are. Well, Percy and I are seeing someone about our issues. She's great. Short, stretchy, really good at guessing past it. Still putting the weak in danger. You never learn. We? Is that why you sent an army to take her down? Right? It's kind of a compliment, actually. I like you more every second, kid. Understand. I 
chose my side five years ago. You showed up and forced my hand. They gave me the girl, and you and Banner can do whatever you want. Forget it. Took the words right out of my mouth. Watch your words. You no longer make the rules. He does. When I was young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. What? Dad said it was too dangerous. He told me to get rid of it. I fed that cub. I named him. I watched him play with my beloved dog, Darwin. You're wasting my time. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. Have you done rambling? Almost. Oh. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me, snarling, frothing at the mouth. Darwin bought me a few precious moments to call for help. My dad shot the wolf. But it was too late. Darwin had been torn to pieces. George. We need him. <laughs> I I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Leave. Please. Jarvis! You haven't aged a day. Welcome back, Mr. Stark. Missed you, buddy. You flying free? In full working order. Give me the worst of it. The Chimera is running on secondary power. Major hull damage is also detected. Engines are offline. Climbing... So it's bad. That is an accurate assessment. Okay, we gotta get this bird airborne. <laughs> Excuse me? AIM knows it's here. So it needs to not be here when they get here. What? All right. While we work on cleanup, you mind taking a look at something for me? Certainly, sir. See what you can do about decrypting this file. At once. Gotta see why the turbines won't activate. Better check out the initiator cores in the hangar. Do I want to know what's going on here? Hey, Tony. Just lending my, um, technical knowledge to Bruce here. Wait, wasn't this working before? Okay, Jarvis. Time me. 1.04 seconds, sir. Huh. Ah, guess I'm a bit rusty. Jarvis, pop question. Where do we keep the spark plugs? The initiator cores can be found in the far corner of the lower deck, sir. Correct, Amundo. Do I win a prize now, sir? You win the biggest prize of all, my affection. How exciting. Oh yeah, that looks perfectly up to safety standards. I think I found the problem. I just... Oh! It's 
definitely the initiator course. Wait, don't the bigger aimbots use similar cores? If we could get a hold of one, I could get this old bird in the air in no time. Indeed, sir. But someone would need to procure said initiator cores. Yeah, I barely have a suit. Maybe I could cobble something together. I'll search inventory for leftover pieces of armor. Thanks, buddy. Hey, Tony, I'm still working on the door, but can you check on Kamala? I think she may have turned off her comms. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah, this whole thing, it's uh, probably a tough adjustment. You got it. Second floor of the old crew quarters, right? Jarvis, can you see if she's even up there? Sir, there are no surveillance systems in the private quarters. Whose terrible hippie idea was that? Yours, sir. Right. Whoa. <gasps> hey! Sorry? You should have knocked. I was trying, uh, I was knocking fist. Jarvis, help me out here. It appears the locking mechanisms on some of the Chimera's crew quarters have not been enabled. There you have it. I will fix that. Please do. I'm gonna meet up on the command deck in about ten minutes. You should, uh, should come. I know, I... I look ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Of course you do. Man... No, 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 no. We all do. It's part of the job. Have you seen Thor's outfit? Flowing robe? Vegas shoulder pads? Pretty ridiculous. <laughs> I am digging this, uh... Oh, it's a burkini. My mom bought it for me. Muslim ladies like to wear it for sports and stuff. It's great. Uh, all right, I'm just gonna change. Wait, 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 wait. The outfit is, is all about attitude. You gotta wear it like you mean it. Show me what you got. Come on, you can do better than that. Yeah, now we're talking? All right. You know what? Maybe I can help you with some upgrades for that. Gear's already spinning. Really? Yeah. Oh, and if Bruce says anything, just remind him that all he wears are super stretchy shorts. <laughs> Bruce, the kid's fine. She's tough. Kind of like her. And she laughs at my jokes. Sir, in case you were wondering, your old room is still intact. You're still working on this door, huh? Well, I just need to remove the entire junction box and reconnect the... Ah! Great job, buddy. See? Wasn't so hard. Home sweet home. All right, if we're gonna get anywhere, we'll need to establish an alternate power source. The Chimera was built for Terrigen, but I can convert it to run on something a little less explody. I'm scanning the region for sources, but it'll take some time to identify potential initiator core heat signatures. Well, in the meantime, I need a new suit. Where can I find parts to repair the fabrication unit? I've located a good salvage spot and have sent the coordinates to the war table. When you're ready. War table, got it. Fix the fabrication unit, get a shiny new suit, then get this bird off the ground.
What is it, Jarvis? Per your request, I've been scanning for residual gamma radiation. I've detected large quantities coming from a complex deep inside AIM territory. AIM and Gamma? How? Monica's trying to replicate my research. And I gave her everything she needed. I'm sorry, Bruce. I trusted her. I assume you'd like to infiltrate the facility. And make sure she stopped. All right, first stop. No way I'm gonna be any help fixing up the Chimera without my own upgrade. Jarvis, what do you got for me? AIM is moving an experimental dropship, which could be appropriated for parts to repair the fabrication machine. Unfortunately, it's extremely well guarded. But AIM's local defenses are designed around a large-scale air assault. If I fly in alone, using the canyon for cover, I should be able to slip through and jack the dropship. It's risky, but I don't see an alternative at this point. I'll upload the dropship's last known location to your HUD. The canyon walls prevent me from fully confirming the intel. I suggest you work quickly. Well, I'm not exactly rocking a state-of-the-art suit, but it should get me there in one piece. Two, max. We need to move fast. Updating your HUD. AIM appears aware of our intrusion. How about we call this a surprise visit? Intrusion makes it sound like we're the bad guys. Noted, sir. Acquisition trip it is. I'm not sure how long our quarry will remain at its location. I hear you. We should hurry. Interesting how many of AIM's systems look closely related to your designs. George never was an original thinker. Makes them compatible though, which is handy. How much firepower does AIM have down here? Rather a lot, it would seem. And how much was Bill with Tech they stole from Stark Industries after A-Day? It's impossible. 